What is up, Lions? King Rat Nick TV here reporting remotely and on location at home where we all are these days with the latest from the Lions news. As you all know, it is an exciting time as we are set to begin our spring break this Friday. While we are limited where we can go and what we can do, this is still an incredible opportunity for you all to take advantage of the many virtual campus tours offered by colleges, technical programs, and military ranks. Principal Gorman will be including at least one link to a virtual campus tour every week in the Friday newsletter, so be sure to check it out. What is up, Lions? Madison here reminding you that even though we are on spring break next week, mill distribution will still take place. District families can go to Gloucester Middle School next Monday, April 12th, between 11 a.m. and noon to pick up a week's worth of breakfast and lunch for all children in the home. Any families having difficulty making it to the meal distribution should email Mr. Gorman directly. Please be sure to bring your school ID or have your school ID number available for meal pickup. How's it going, Lions? Maddox C coming at you with some big news. College will release the results from the March 2020 SAT school day. The results are in and the top six student achievement average almost 1375 out of a possible 1600. Those top six are Rachel Chen with 1560, Thomas Billings with 1450, Karen Rutherow with 1350, Melissa Ritchie with 1330, Chris Castro with 1280, and Emily Keith with 1270. Those are some of the highest results in our school's proud history. We'll continue to analyze them and create instruction across all grade levels going forward. What's happening, Lions? Gavin Callahan here, letting all my fellow seniors know that we are working with the World Class Vacation on nearly a daily basis to maintain the tradition of a senior class trip to this year's outstanding graduating class. At this time, the trip has been rescheduled for Saturday, June 6th through Wednesday, June 10th. Yes, this has us returning home the night before commencement. Any family who would like to cancel and have their child removed from the trip list at this time will be fully refunded. Must email Mr. Gorman by Monday, April 20th. Our travel agent has assured us that if the Disney parks will still be closed as of June 6th, we will reschedule the trip for late June or July. We have confirmed with our insurance agent the trip participants will still be covered in this event. What is up, Lions Nation? Mr. Young here, reminding you all that Saturday was National Librarian Day. Please join us all in showing our appreciation. All the support Ms. Donahue continues to provide all of us, our students, and our families each and every day. Also, the National Association of Elementary School Principals and the American Federation of School Administrators have declared this week National Assistant Principals Week to honor and recognize the contributions assistant principals make in success of students in schools across the United States. Make sure to also give a big shout out and a big thank you to Ms. Finley and Dr. Kellogg for their invaluable daily contributions that they make to each and every one of us, all the students, the families, and staff. And now, for a very special new feature for our Lions News, here are some special guests who would like to say hello to the students in Lions Nation. Enjoy. All right, Lions. Just taking a quick break from my new uh, TikTok stardom these days. Not easy. But want to make sure wish you guys all a happy spring break you know let you guys know how much i miss all of you i love all you guys man i can't wait for the day we're all back together stay positive stick together do the things that make you happy be around the people that make you happy um you know enjoy some much needed time off and if you're out for a uh, for a walk or a bike ride and you're in the neighborhood of mercer street and when you see your uh, dear old principal dunking on his and Mr. Bakey's kids, right on by, man. I'll stay six feet away from you. All right. Have a great break. I'll see you all real soon. Hi, Lions. Good morning. It's Miss Donahue. I hope that you're all doing well. I just wanted to film a short little video saying that I miss you. Um, I hope that you are all getting to enjoy the warm weather that we've been having. Get outside, get some fresh air from a safe social distance. Um, I know that that's been my favorite thing to do at the end of the day is to just go out and get a walk around my development. I hope that you're all doing well, and I hope that I will get to see you soon. Um, it's nice to be able to look forward to spring break where we'll get a little bit of free time away from our distance learning. Bye. Hey Gloucester City High School, how are you? I hope all of you 
students, your families, everybody's healthy and well. Please do what the CDC is recommending. Stay six feet apart, wash your hands, cover your sneezes and coughs, and just take care of each other. Because as soon as we open those doors, I want everybody back. Please keep up with your schoolwork too. I know how hard your teachers are working on their virtual lessons. Don't slack off now. Stay strong, persevere, show that we're resilient. That's what lions are, we're lion strong. Hopefully next week on spring break, everybody can just relax, unwind a little bit. I'm hoping to get out on my bike. I'd love to see some faces, just to say hi, get my eyes on you because I miss everybody so much. I love you guys. Stay healthy and well and take care. Hey everybody, hope you are all doing well and you're know, finding things that you can still do that you enjoy, staying in touch with family and friends and remaining positive. Know we're here if you need us for anything. Uh, everybody's done a great job so far and we wish you all the best for the rest of this week and heading into the break. Have a happy Easter and a nice break. All right, Lions, Mr. McConnell here. Just dealing with the hand that we've been dealt. All right, but it's time to take this negative and turn it into a positive. Make sure that you're making a difference in the life of you and your family. Get out and exercise. Um, help your parents around the house. Maybe get out and do some yard work. Um, you know, maybe read a book outside. Play some family games. FaceTime with your friends, with your family. Definitely get out and reach out to your grandparents, aunts and uncles, um, or just someone that you think might be in need. Make sure you're staying on top of your schoolwork. I know, know that the teachers are here to help and assist you in any way. Um, and continue to follow the rules that have been put forth um, to help try to keep you and your family safe. Just remember that everybody has the same 24 hours in a day. It's what you do with them that matters. I want everybody out there to enjoy your spring break. Reach out if you need help. And even though we're apart, we're all in this together. All right, have fun with your families. We're all looking forward to being together again soon. And as always, go Lions. Vicky B here with a special announcement for all of our juniors. Plans are being created to convert this year's Rising Senior Night for our junior families to a totally virtual format. Stay tuned to our newsletters and broadcasts for updates. And some good news for seniors, few and far between these days. Our guide staff has distributed local scholarship information and applications to you in the Senior Google Classroom. Over $25,000 in scholarship money will be awarded to seniors thanks to the generosity of many local families, businesses, and organizations. Take advantage of these incredible opportunities to offset the cost of your education after GHS. Seniors needing any help with these applications can email Mrs. Bobo. Don't waste any time. All applications are due on May 1st. We've had a few birthdays over the past week. Happy birthday to our own mighty Matt Carfagno and Sonny Nate, Lily Blodgett, Olivia Dolson and Yanan Hart, Thomas Donahue, Angel Delgado, Sarah Bonney, Dylan Breslin, Chloe Murphy, Sebastian Paradise, and Colin Stinsman, Richard Rodriguez, and McRib himself, Zachary Wilkie. From all of us here at the Lions Pride News Network, happy birthday to each and every one of you. All right, Lions, that's all for today's episode. Stay tuned to all of GHS social media outlets to keep yourself involved and informed. Make it a great spring break, everybody. Have a nice spring break, everyone. Go Lions. Hey, everybody. Mr. Driscoll here on behalf of everyone from the Lions Pride News Network. We want to wish you all a very safe and happy spring break. Remember, we got to stick together. Even though we can't be together, stay safe out there. And as always, go Lions.